All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are still up here at Salisbury, Spencer Control Point in particular, and uh, coming southbound will be a grain train 52V, as in Victor. Pulling out of the old yard on the main one. But when I last looked, which is maybe right before I started recording this, they didn't have a signal down there at Salisbury. So I don't know, but they do have some sort of foreign power, maybe heritage unit, third in the lash up. Canadian Pacifics, the third unit. SD-70M leading. SD-60M. And uh, CP-ES-44 AC. I think they got their signal. Yes, they did. Probably be pulling somewhat easy coming out of the yard. Catch your fair share of grain trains up and around here, at least I have. 50B, 52W, 51X. Called a bunch of them. day so far. We got a bit of a late start. Overslept a little. But I still managed to catch 
211, which was running several hours late. Then I called Amtrak's PO73. Then 214, which was running a couple hours late. And then P94 with a tier four leading. Who would have thought that? And then uh, caught the meat of 135 and 76M at the Jalica. Caught P29 taking some engines to Barber at the Jalica. And caught P61 coming up the hill at five row. And now 52V. Well, no, call 74 just a second ago. Then I call uh, 52V, which is the one right here, pulling on to the main grain train. Probably going down to our line to either Chester, Chester, or Manetta. I guess they're going to stop at Carolina Rubber. The 154 still down there. Charles, that's 52V. 52V. Are you on the move or you got to get another two minutes in there? Yeah, we're going to stop at Carolina Rubber. Okay, let me know when you get on the head and y'all ready to go. Yes, sir, we'll do that. They gonna put a pusher. They gonna stop down at Carolina Rubber and get a get them a pusher. Maybe. And there goes the rear. Uh, 52V. We're going to go back up to 5 row because they're supposed to be pulling 154 sometime soon. And then we got 213, P99, E80, whatever the hell they call themselves today. 119. And maybe a Danville District train or two if it's worth driving up there for. Alright everybody, we'll be back.